Hello, this is Greth, and welcome to a pilot episode of sorts. I am going to try and do a decent game. Yes, you heard right. I am actually going to do uh, a game there where people won't kill their own hatcheries and things like that. So this is Honfresh vs. Ever T All. I don't know the players, I'm sorry. But this is indeed a legitimate attempt at me doing a serious game. Run for the hills. It has happened. Oh, and right away, so we will, uh, well, first of all, probe, going very fast. I think we might see a proxy attempt here from Fresh going in here. So these players actually know how to play the game. I will not bore you too much with in-depth analysis, but I won't be bashing on them as much. Well, unless they do something stupid, of course. So this little probe is the focus of all of our attention right at the start of the game. What is he going to do? Yes, he is going to plant down a pylon, so we will see a little bit of a proxy, probably followed by a gateway. Yes, we will actually see some Greth Starcraft knowledge here as well. I might actually get it completely wrong, of course, but we'll see. So the Terran is going to be in a problem, but this pylon, right? This, the placement of this pylon, I will, I will remark, is right in front of these two buildings, right in front of these two bridges even. This scouting SUV is going right, to run his face straight onto it. The probe's now, now going to fake a scout, but this SUV is going to go, it's pretty, well, no. Yeah, it's a pretty early scout as well, because it's before the, the first deep, depot is ready, and that SUV is going to run straight into that swirling little blue ball there, and it's going to see it, and whoa, look at that. So, ever T all, ever, sending off five SEVs going to run that pro probe's trying to get be a bit irritating trying to stop doing a good job at trying to stop these look at that he's blocking the entire line and every as SEVs gonna go in but is that that gateway's gonna go up un unimpeded and half of the shields are already done that probe's still alive still attempting to be as annoying as possible occupying one of the SEVs but this is gateway the Zella first Zella is being produced so still Fresh is going to build that first zealot. Is it going to be ready, however? That probe still being irritating, but it hasn't killed anything so far, just mildly damaging. And that gateway, the zealot has been cancelled, and that gateway is going to go down. So, right, that proxy attempt really failing now. The refinery going up. So we don't have... Do we have marines? We don't have a marine yet. Doesn't isn't really necessary. Terran is a bit behind on, on mining. I don't know how much he actually lost there. It probably will. He will probably have lost more than 150 uh, minerals there on mining time. But anyway, it saved him. So that one pylon being destroyed. Ah shit! That one pylon being destroyed by a single lone SUV. Yes, yeah, sorry about that. I'm just a quick ninja switch. Ho! 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 Hey, there we go. Sorry, had to quit Ventrilo before people were going to start blabbering into my mouth, uh, into my ears. Even yes, good. So first marine out is going to probably help out some more. The, the probe's still alive though. A little scouting probe. So what's happening in the Protoss base? So Cybernet is called second gateway, and the first gateways had been placed here, and we're going for the core straight away. We'll see what's going to happen. More pylons here now. SCP's almost got it down to 50 HP here. Two Marines gonna go up and mob that up. So that's the end of that factory going up now. So we'll see what's going to happen now. Uh, Camp Protoss, that little bit of an advantage. I think that that little proxy, um, well, I'm not sure. He could have produced some, uh, some Marie, uh, no. I'm not going, no, it was a good reaction, but he did lose a lot of mining time there. So I think it's pretty even right now. Uh, let's see. So another scouting SUV going in. Chosen damaged one, however. <laughs> a damaged SUV with two kills, by the way. This is a real beast of an SUV. It's going to take that down that probe, no problem, I think. Let's see. Yeah, it's, it's being micro. It's going to get in and going to scout it. So it's Dragoon range being upgraded, and we have two Dragoons being built now. But I think Terran's pretty prepared. Let's see what's going to happen. His machine shop is going up and he's building a lot of marines. Probably going to fight that off if Protoss decides to attack. Let's see, finally had yeah, a manly SUV getting taken down there. Two kills on it. Goon's gonna go in. And whoa, what we have here? We have a starport in the back. So, 
We probably will be seeing some drops. So Terran feeling he is behind somewhat. So he will try to do a vulture drop probably to get back in. And get a stable, well an, an equal economy really. Two Dragoons going to try and get in here. But there are four Marines. Six Marines even. And that first tank. That tank's going to be out right in time. I think halfway through. Dragoons going to go in. So more two more Dragoons. So Pearl's really going to press with his attack. Range is not yet upgraded though, so I don't think will he, if he waits, it's going to be it's gonna be difficult to actually do some damage here. Mine's being researched, so we will see. There we go. Starport is ready, and those dragoons testing the defense, but they get damaged by that. Tanks out, there's no way he's gonna get up here. Retreat, little fellow, retreat. Yeah. Darren's going to push out. I don't know how that's going to work out. Four dragoons here now. Gonna go in, going to try and pick off that one Dragoon, microing it away, one Dragoon goes down. They're not focusing anything, they're focusing the Marines, they should be focusing on the, on the tank here. Try to snipe that off, but there's not enough Dragoons and the bridges really make it difficult. Yeah, that <laughs> mine being placed by that Vulture, sort of giving that away. Right, so dropship being produced now that the control tower is up. And an expansion going for the Protoss. This might actually be pretty dangerous if Terran decides to push. There's only two gateways now. Let's see if there's anything else. Oh well, yeah, a robotics facility going up. But, well. We'll see what is going to happen here. We've got three Dragoons. We've got two more in the gates. But this is, the bridge, of course, makes it a bit narrow, hard to micro, and Terran has to back off. It don't, I don't, it hasn't seen that Nexus up there yet. He does have to retreat. I don't think uh, Siege Tech isn't upgraded yet, so he can't really do anything about that. So Proto's going to be safe for this little second. Uh, dropship 